Hello everybody, I am the Pontic Mercenary, and La Egla, or however it's pronounced, was just released. So, I'm going to go ahead and jump in and start a new game. It's a pretty awesome mod, taking place during the Napoleonic Wars. I think it's the years 1803, I think. Anyways, it's been in development for about three years or so. 1809, so 1809. Okay, so we'll go ahead and just... Uh, do our character selection. So when you, while you were a child, your father was. Soldier sounds good. As a child, your family scrabbled out a meager living from your father's wages as a sergeant in the army. It's not an easy existence, and you were too poor to get much of an education. Your father could teach you few things besides fighting. My early life, hunter's assistant. That's always cool. You lived and learned from an expert woodsman, learning every detail of the operation of a firelock as well as how to survive without reliance on any other person. Before long, you could build a shelter from nothing and tumble a moving bucket 300 yards. Then as a young adult, life changed as it always does. You became, let's see, trapper or gun for, uh, gun for hire. Mercenaries by are always cool. All right, <clears throat> so let's see, what made you take this decision? Wonderlust, we'll go with that. And we'll go on our way. So, there were some points. My intelligence and charisma is kind of low, but strength and agility seem to be most important. Do another iron flesh and power strike. Athletics probably needs to go up. My writing is good. Uh, I probably don't need that yet. Rooting could be useful. Inventory management's low. And so, uh, prisoner management's important. Sell slaves. So, I'll probably need to cut points in both of these. Ah, and then my name. Just a uh, standard name. Something that seems like it fits. Clement Montburn. On to my face. Interesting. Interesting. Let's see what the options are. What kind of beards are here? Ah, interesting stuff. I think, okay, I think that's all of them, yeah. Let's see what hair there is. Okay, some new ones here. Well, let's see. Kind of an outdoorsy woodman mercenary, so I don't know, maybe some long hair would be nice. Maybe like some kind of beard. There's one of those, something like that. Yeah, I think that fits. And I'm not gonna worry about any of this stuff over here. But, you know, you can always further customize it. So, okay. So I had to stop and look for a tavern in. We got Paris, London, Frankfurt, Vienna, Berlin, or St. Petersburg. Well, probably end up joining the French, so I'll just start there in Paris. And, yeah, I didn't read any of that, so moving on. You've spilled my drink, you rat. What have you to say for yourself? All right. Some insults back and forth. Someone's watching. And, okay, we'll go into this... This duel then. So pistol or sword? Well, let's do sword. Test my blocking skills and see how well. The pistol duel is cool too, but we'll do this. Okay, let's. Oh, that was close. Oh, now he's getting on me. Maybe this was a bad idea. Okay, come on. Uh, yeah. Not going too great so far. He seems to be faster than me, which seems unfair. He doesn't seem to do very much damage either. There we go. Oh, I killed the guy too. Oh, man. Yes. That's the last duel he'll be fighting. Thank you. Victory. Alright. Yes, that slept fine. That's good to hear. You'll need your strength in a place like this. Anyway, don't come for small talk. I am here to come clean with you. Tavern drunk. Duel to death accomplished. Okay, okay. It looks like we're about to have our first mission. Yeah. Where do I sign up? Alright. Nice. We'll go after these guys. Let's see. Well, 
Yeah, I'm gonna need to do some recruitment first. I can actually do some recruitment probably in Paris. There's no okay. No one here wants to uh join up with me, so while I'm moving though, just take a look at this map. Quite big. Huge actually. <laughs> okay, no one there wants to join me there. And yeah, this is just this is alpha, I should mention, so there are gonna be some bugs and different things and with a further release as a lot of this other territory in some of these areas will be filled up with uh, more factions and different things, so definitely something to look forward to. Let's see. I'll go down here and do some more recruitment. Uh, one. I'll probably get some cavalry. And I'm not sure what the difference is between some of the cavalry, but at least at start, having a small cavalry force will hopefully allow us to be faster, a little more feared, and Calvary is awesome anyway, so three more men. That should be good. Where is the... yes, over here. So yeah, we have five guys, including myself, so this shouldn't be too much of a problem at all. Alright, surrender or die. Charge the enemy. And yeah, <laughs> I'm the leader of these men, but yet I don't have a horse. That's something I'm gonna have to make sure I get horse. So, yeah, they should be charging. It shouldn't be too much. Yeah, I won't have to worry about any formations or anything. Just let them charge out and take those few guys. And I'll try to get at least one kill when I get up there. If I can get up there fast enough. Yeah, it's gonna take a while. I think they started fighting already without me. Yep, I can hear him up ahead. Good job, men. Or not. A simple high moon, high women? These cavalrymen. Gonna have to teach them how to ride. Alright, here we go. First shot. And I miss. There we go. Nice, nice. And another smuggler down. One left. Or two. I'm not sure. Two. I'll go ahead and reload. Actually, let me see if I can take this mount. Nope. Writing goes around a bit. Okay, we'll start reloading Why they occupy those the last two smugglers. Okay, one of them's coming over. Let's see if I can get this done in time. Oh, he left. And another one down. Oh, he's gone now too. Oh man. Quite a bit of damage to the Oh I <laughs> took out his horse. My bad. I'll do whatever you want. I'll spare your life in exchange I want information. Alright. And nice, got some stuff. Hunting musket cannot be used in horseback. Let's see. So I got smoked fish. That's I need to make sure that's on top. Um, oh, nice. 175 for that. Yeah, that's not better than what I have. How does that look? Uh, I don't want that. Those are slightly better. All right. So let's see. We need to go back now, don't we? Go back to the tavern and let this guy know what's up. We caught the bandits and now we know where to go, so. Oh, that's not good. There's no need to fight. Huh. Okay, I'm gonna have to sacrifice some guys. I can't fight 10 of them. That's just crazy. Don't worry, we'll have a revenge sometime. Very cool looking tavern. Very cool. Alright, yes, success. Let's see, you're in a few coins. Now that we know we're hiding, I'll gather my officers and run us together for an attack. Alright, so I'll go ahead and uh, go with them, accompany them on this attack. Yeah, most of them are his men, custom officers. Oh wow, they're already starting to fire. So let's, let's see, let's see, I'll bring them over here. And 
I guess I am controlling his men, which is pretty cool. Should be coming. Make ready, present. Form up. We're gonna have to move up a little bit more. Come on, guys. Here we go. Let's see what other buttons do I have over here. Double rank. See what it looks like if I don't have that many men for it. Line up. Take aim. And fire. Nice. One kill out of like 20 guys here. Luckily, they're just standing there. Alright, take aim. Ready. And fire. There we go. Someone just got hit. Okay, we've got some guys down there, and some over here. But they just have rocks they're throwing. And then I guess some, what, two guys over there? Anyways. We'll take them out one by one. Alright guys, turn around. Get ready to fire. Men ready? Nope, they're all still. Ready, aim, fire. I'm gonna just charge. <laughs> we'll finish off these last little bit, guys. Seems to be some problem with, whoop, with how the musket works. That's okay. We got our knife to switch to. Oh wow, that's not good. That guy got knocked unconscious. I'm going to back up. Wait for these guys. Let them fire at will. They should be charging too. I'll reload. Nope, oh, that guy had the pistol. I need to play back up. Okay, they got him. So, got some guys over there. We'll go. And then, still those guys over there. I'll let them go do their thing though. They should start firing. Let's see if I can sneak up on these guys. Let me reload real quick. It's the only, the only bad thing about weapons like these is having to reload. Especially in quick little battles like this. You know, it's a lot cooler when you have larger scale things. But wait time in between small skirmishes like this. But the last, these are the times. So, yeah, I'm going to get a little bit closer on top of this rock. To really sneak up on them. Even though that guy's looking straight at me. Boom, there we go. And the other guy don't. That was close. We should probably finish reloading about the same time. Those guys still. They really need to get closer. Or not. I'm like apparently getting quite a few kills. Sneak up on this guy while he's aiming elsewhere. And of course I miss. Let's see if I can take him out. Oh, no, this is not good. I feel I have a bad feeling about this. Yeah. Hopefully those guys can uh, finish this up. Nope. It's not going to let me. That sucks. Bad start to this. Let's see what this guy has to say, though. Was he able to finish it up by himself? Alright, he was. Perhaps we'll meet again? Yes, maybe. And yeah, here's a little uh, glitch of sorts that still needs some fixing. It will forever let me get more money, so a bit of an exploit, but I can use some money just to help me on my way. Alright, that should be enough. Let's see who this Jade Beard is. An old Jack Tar, are we? Aye, I am. The one that got the devil to pay at that. You see, I was saving as the boat swaying on a navy sloop. Life was hard aboard our vessel. But send me to the death for it ain't the life I love. That is until the spat of war has made life that much tougher on us. 
It's got to the point where me and my crew had had enough of Navy life, so we expressed our displeasure with the ship's captain by dropping him and his lackeys and on some uncharted island and committing ourselves to using the ship for a better purpose. Alas, some of them Navy boys caught up with us and we had nary a choice to but dive overboard and swim for dear life. Yeah, I'll take my board. Nice. Dreadbeard with us now. And, oh, who's that? Dandy General? What was his name? Oh, well, he's gone. To the marketplace. Let's see. I have some stuff to sell. Don't need that. That. Actually. No, actually, I don't. Well, yeah, no. I'll leave that. Don't need those either. Yeah, I'll get rid of that. So. I'll have a little bit of money. Not much. But let's see if I can actually buy a horse. 285. That's kind of expensive. I don't even have that much. And yeah, I mean, my weapon's fine for now. Although I wouldn't mind a better sword, but we'll see. Wow. Dark is rather dark, isn't it? So let's see. Start talking to uh, some of the vassals around here. See if we can get some missions to go on. Nice to meet you. Yes, decent enough. Tasks. Okay, a lawless villain was Bertrand the Scar Scarred. Murdered one of my men. Bounty of 300. Nice, nice. Where is he at? Narbon. Alright, let's go after him. So, we can find this city, wherever it may be. Is that it? No, that's Napoleonville. I wonder who named that town. Nope, nope. Where is it? Namor, Luxembourg, Troy, Serenberg, Dijon. Must be where Mustard gets his name. Oh, Narbonne, right here. Nice, nice. Quite a ways away. Hopefully we shouldn't have any trouble on our journey, though. Uh, let me stop in New Orleans real quick, actually. Nice. So we'll get some heavy cavalry or lion infantry. Get some lion infantry since we don't have any. And that should hopefully make us... Or at least deter anybody from coming up to us. How many do we got? Nine? Uh, that may still be too little, but... Yeah, there's a 12 chasing us, but yeah, he won't be able to catch us. So, onward. Let's assassinate this guy. Although, I guess assassinate probably isn't the right word. He's a bad guy. He deserves to die, so... That makes it okay. <laughs> probably should have recruited first. I guess it's not that big of a deal. Okay, that seems to be a little bit of a texture problem, maybe. I don't know. It's actually pretty cool, though. <laughs> those are really white. Anyways, we'll look for the sketchy guy who's standing behind a building, like that guy. No, he just looks to be glitched out. Yeah, he's just a villager. Yep, that guy over there. Look at him just standing there all suspicious like. Bet you that's our man. Make sure my gun's ready. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess he doesn't have any weapons. Oh, well. I'll use him as a meat shield. I guess he's not too concerned about the guy running at him with a bayonet. I'll talk to him from afar so I have room to shoot. Looking for a murderer? Okay, no problem. I just need your head. Oh, that didn't even kill him. Attack him, Dreadpart. Dreadbeard. Whatever your name is. There we go. Thanks for taking that stab. So, another another one done. Let's see. Talk to that guy again. Where is he at? Ant nine Droyot, whatever your name is. All the way back up. Do we have money though? Yes, we can still recruit then. Pick up some recruits down here. Uh just take some more infantry. So yeah, my plans. I figured good decent army built up. Get some uh, some better equipment, stuff like that. And once I have some money down and everything too, I'll establish myself a little bit. Then I'll try to join uh, probably the French. I mean, since I started over here, I'll join them, become a vassal. And I'll probably do that for a while until I'm ready to strike it on my own and start my own kingdom. That's, that's the plan. So, yeah, we'll find this guy. 
and that'll probably be good for this episode. I can see this guy might know where he's at. Oh, look, Napoleon, let's talk to him. Yes, Emperor Napoleon I, nice. Any tasks? Okay, oh, that'll be nice. So, Cien. Okay, let me talk to him too to see if he knows where this other guy's at, actually. Location of someone, let's see. I don't even remember the guy's name. Yeah, I must have passed it. Let's start at the top. Okay, it wasn't Luis, Andre, Jean Baptiste, Charles Pierre, Nicholas, Charles, Augustus. Oh, here it is. I think it's this guy. Okay. Copenhagen. Or however you pronounce all these names. Let's see. He's on his way to Paris, though. He's going to become. Okay, he's going to be coming from this side. See if we can cut him off. And is that him? Yep. About the task you gave me, I found him. Okay, there we go. 300 experience, level 2 now. I'll take the money. I don't mind taking blood money. <laughs> Does he have any more tasks? Uh Oh, nice. The Grouchy. The Grouchy Man. Certainly. Paris is right here, so... That's no problem at all. Yep, knees inside. So we'll do this. We'll finish this up. Go to the city hall. And pass it on. Man, this is pretty cool. Never have I ever seen anything like this in Warband before. Got the guard station outside. Oh man, you can see outside the city. It's awesome. Very well done. Is this Grouchy Man? Yes. I'm Clement Montburn. Emmanuel de Grouchy. All right. Yes, a peasant now. Yes, yes. Okay, so a message. Any tasks? Nope. Okay. Well, I think that's it for this episode. I'll probably end it here. I'll get over and have like a cool shot to end it on. Yes. Look at this painting. We'll end the video like this. And yeah, stay tuned for part two. We'll probably uh, do that other quest I have. Yes, the taxes. We'll do that and then go from there. So thanks for watching and stay tuned for part two.